Okay, so this is a slightly harder frog to make now. Um, so again, if we want a square piece of paper, just start with a, an ordinary piece of paper, fold it across, and then cut very carefully along that line, and then you'll have a square. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to open up that square and fold it along the other way. And there's going to be lots of folds here, so we need to take care to, to make the folds very carefully. So now we've got uh, some diagonal folds, and then we're going to fold along the lengthways. Now I've got this Union Jack sort of shape, and then we're going to fold that in to make a square. So there are four flaps on this square, one, two, three, four, and everything else that we're going to do is going to be times four. So the first thing we're going to do is take one of those flaps and fold it into the middle, and then unfold it but then squash it down like this. Okay. I'm going to do this times four but we'll just do this one to begin with. So I take the flap, fold it down and then I'm going to take this edge here, fold it into the middle, do the same on the other side. And then take that flap and fold it back up. This is probably the trickiest bit just to get that right. So just fold it up like that, take your time and eventually you should find that, that pulls back like that. Okay, so that's what we're going to do four times. So we've done it once, let's fold it over and let's do it on the next flap. So again, I'm going to fold it out. I'm going to fold these in. And then lift up the flap, tuck these inside, and then just very gently push this back until those folds back nicely over here. Okay. And then we do that another two times, and we'll end up with something like this. Okay, so now we've folded everything in nicely. And then if I turn one flap, I get a blank piece here. And so what I'm going to do now is fold from the other side, fold into that blank piece on both sides. Okay, so I'm going to do that. So it looks like that. Okay, so that's one, and again we're going to have to do this four times. So let me turn that over and let me do the same thing over here. I'm going to fold this flap in here. This is where we need to be a little bit careful because the folds are getting quite a lot. And again, I'm going to do that four times. So four times I need to do that. And when I've done that, I'll get something that looks a little bit like this. And... Uh, that's the bit I folded in, and that's the front and the back. So I'm going to start with the back, and now I'm going to take one of these lengths here and bend it up. And these are going to become the legs of the frog. So I'm going to bend that one up on that side. And I'm going to bend this one up on this side. And now I'm going to turn this one down like that and do the same on the other side. So if you can see what I'm doing is I'm just opening them up and turning them around. Try and get them to be a little bit even. It's not easy to make it perfect. And then finally, the last little bit, I'm going to just turn that bit there just to make the end of the foot. Again, I'm going to turn this bit here to make the end of the foot. And you might find they're not that accurate by the time you got to this part here. So that's the, the legs on the one side, and then the four legs on the other side, I'm gonna turn them over, 
I'm going to do exactly the same thing. I'm going to take this one and bend him up and bend him up so he's about there. And the same on this side, I'm going to turn him over, bend it up, and those are the four legs. And then very carefully, I'm going to take the middle section of here and the middle section of here, and I'm going to pull very gently. And there's my frog.